what inherent strengths Kalyani Group brings to this field? See, the word over the weapon platform manufacture started from metals, metallurgy, metal forming. That's the strength which we also enjoy. We have a steel mill which can make the best of the steels. We have a forging capability, we have machining capability, fabrication capability, metal forming. And then we brought system engineering knowledge and that's how we are able to develop a platform. So we are following actually the same path which some of the large players in the world have followed. And this is real make in India, isn't it? 100%. These are Indian design, developed, manufactured. It's real make in India. And, and you've recently tied up with Saab. Tell us a little bit about what that tie-up is about. So, okay. With Saab, we are tied up for air defense uh, systems. Uh, there are two of such programs which are going on. One is called Vishwara and another is SRSAM. <clears throat> we are tied up for them doing maximum work in India. And uh, hopefully, if they win the program, and which we wish and hope it will happen soon, will be the manufacturing part. And what hopes do you have about being being uh, summoned by the Indian Armed Forces for trials with your current uh, weapon systems? I mean, do you see any potential in future? We are very excited about the new DPP. I believe uh, it is going to give us options to select uh, under the Indian Design Developed Manufacture category. We are very hopeful. And, and do you think that you fit the bill when it comes to IDDM? Of course, we <laughs> fully met the bill. Thanks, Mr. Bhatia. Thank, Thank you so much for talking to us. Thank you, sir. Thank you. Right. That was Mr. Rajinder Bhatia, President and CEO of the Kalyani Group, talking to us about his company's foray into the defense sector. You're watching Stratpost.